Hello everyone, and welcome to Dynamics 365 Portals Tips from Engineered Code. My name is Nicholas Hayduk, and this is tip number 10, Collaboration in the Partner Portal. The Partner Portal is all about letting an organization's partners create and manage their opportunities. In this tip, I'll describe what happens when more than one partner needs to be involved in a single opportunity. The standard opportunity scenarios revolve around a single partner working on an opportunity but in some cases, multiple partners may need to contribute. This is possible through the Partner Collaboration feature. Partner Collaboration is enabled by Dynamics 365 users by checking the field in the Partner Pipeline section on the Opportunity form. Once checked, the Partner Collaboration Accounts section will appear, which contains a subgrid of accounts. Simply associate Partner Account Records here to enable Partner Collaboration. Partner collaboration opportunities do not appear in the distributed opportunities area on the portal, and they do not need to be accepted. They appear immediately in the managed opportunities area. You'll see the partner collaboration column is set to yes for those opportunities. There are certain restrictions associated with collaborative opportunities. There are no options to close as won or lost, or to return the opportunities. When viewing the form, most of the fields are read only. Partners can, however, add notes, products, and partner contacts to the opportunity. It's important to note that collaborative opportunities are implemented using out-of-the-box portals functionality, including entity lists and entity forms. So any of these restrictions can be removed if desired. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Dynamics 365 Portals tip number 10 from Engineered Code on collaboration in the Partner Portal useful.